Hi friends, now we are going to uh, talk about how we can add some useful information in the header row of the output in FBL 3 So FBL 3 and most of you all use if you are on the GL side, okay? So here I have some GL and I'll just put open items, okay? So the list is being generated. So you have GL account here. Now what I want, I want some more information here. So what I go settings and I go to layout, I will current header row and here I'll just put, suppose let me see what I want to add. So I'll click create characteristics and let's see what is there. So you have accounting group, company code, uh, we have company code here already. So we don't need company code. Let's see something very important probably we can give tax group training partner valuation group you know account currency well we can probably we can give chart of accounts okay so what i'll do is i'll click chart of accounts and i'll make it intense and i'll click the green this and here can i space it so here it will show as chart but what i'll go i'm going to do is i'll give a description so what i'm going to do i'll give a chart of accounts and here I'll add the characteristics chart of accounts. I'll make it intense. Okay. And I hope it has a chart of accounts. Now here we'll say save. Yes. And here you can see the chart of accounts is there everywhere. Wonderful, isn't it? So this is the way you can add useful information rather than bringing it here because you have a certain limit you have so here if you can add some useful information that would be very useful okay so that's that would be great okay so this covers everything how we can do uh, add useful information in the header row in fbl3 stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and have a great day